Hello guys, uh, welcome to a video on how to use rockets and how to assemble them at YOLO and do what I'm going to show you. They are quite cool and they work only often, so often. Yeah, so let's get straight into it. So cool. Okay. Now we will go over the parts that you need uh, to assemble the missile. So it's impact fuse, high explosive fuel module, and thruster module. If you search for missile, you will find all these components. You will find the launcher here as well. And except the launcher, you also need the fixed launcher mount. It's hard to find um, because it doesn't have the missile name in it. And it's not a hard point to make it all work together. Now you just need to assemble the missile. It goes the thruster fuel, uh, the explosive, and the warhead. Uh, after you have this ready, uh, you just lock the missile in the fuel module. Uh, change zero to one. And what it does is it allows the missile to stay together. If you unlock it, you can use the button here. It falls into pieces. Before we start putting the missiles into the launcher, we need to check a few properties. You don't want to touch any of these three fields after you lock it. All you want to change in here is the safety timer, change it to two. So when the missile launches from your ship, um, it doesn't hit you and damage your ship. Um, we can actually maybe keep it at one because two would probably invalidate targets that are close to us. Um, but yeah, the, the one will be enough, I think. Um, after that, you can load the launcher. You just have to keep the missiles in a way that the thruster aligns uh, with the back of it and stick out a little bit, right? So, because if you do it the other way around, uh, the missile will just not function at all. So, when this is on the back side, this is the back, this is the front. Okay, so, once we have everything assembled and connected to our ship, you want to change the properties of the missile launcher. Uh, set, select, tube, you just want to rename it to cell. Uh, what it does, it will select one of the tubes, unlock it, and set the missile free if you press the uh, fire button. Um, the first value just selects one of the tubes and unlocks it. Now, uh, why is the unlock important to have? What it does, if you press the fire button, it takes one of the rockets, it unlocks one of the tubes, and it fires it. Then the script we have, that I will show later, just cycles through those missiles. They go so fast that the animation doesn't show up every time. Uh, but it just, it's just selecting those tubes one after another and firing those missiles. Okay, so this is the YOLO script that you need. You need one basic YOLO chip, just put it into a socket, connect it to power. Uh, it defines some of the names we have and the launcher, and it just does some YOLO magic with them. It just cycles through those tubes. It's not important how it works exactly. Uh, it was not even made by me. But I'm able. I'm allowed to use this script, and you are able to use it too. Uh, so I will just paste it into the description and paste it into your chip, and that's all you need to know for now. The last part you need to launch missiles is a button. It should say "Launch missile." Be at zero, on state one, off state zero, button star zero. So once you have it all, we just connect the button to the ship network with the YOL chip and the launcher itself, full of rockets, it has to be locked, missiles have to be rocked, and the values, you can see them 
in here. Uh, once you have it all connected, you can place multiple rocket launcher. You should know that they count towards the weapon limit, so maximum amount of rockets you can have is 30. And with this script, you can have only 9 shots. It would be more difficult to have more, so they like fire one after another. For the most basic rocket setup, I think this is enough. And then all you need to do is to just bind your rockets to some button. I have it on ALT. I do not recommend using ALT because if you ALT tap, it will fire a rocket. All right. Uh, but when you, it's all binded, you can fire the rockets. Sometimes they break and sometimes they don't even fly straight. Sometimes they do. Okay, I hope it was helpful. Uh, thanks again, fan, for the help with the URL script, and I will see you sometimes next time. Uh, subscribe and like the video if you liked it, and I hope it helped you. See ya!